Happy Sunday, everybody, as yes, I am here with you and you are here with me, Kiara the Voice, and we are joined here together on the most amazing, beautiful, uplifting, intentional Sunday. Yes, 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 yes. We are accompanied by the energy, the presence of this amazing, amazing, amazing new moon. And I want to take a few moments at the top of this Sunday video just to take a moment of recognizing all of the great energies that we have been able to experience on this earth in the form that they choose to be in and for their ascension on to their next level of fueling us through spirit and us being able to really take in all that it was that their mission was while they were here on this earth and we were able to embrace, we were able to be touched by, we were able to see the growth that comes from someone who is actually being able to live a life of fulfillment without limits. Sending so much love and energy and prayers to the Rough Riders crew, DMX, man. So much of my youth <laughs> uh, has to do with that king right there, but I am going to focus on just how amazing and how vibrational and how important it is to live and be true into your purpose fully. Fully yourself in all circumstances and advocating your truth always, no matter where you are, no matter who is listening, but always being authentically adherent to your heart. And there's certain people that we get to experience in this lifetime, whether they be scientists or artists or doctors or whatever, that really stay true to the core of the purpose that exudes within them, the purpose, the thing that drives them to be as daring as they are with the words that they choose, with the actions they choose, with the energy they choose in which to share and how they share it and be so pure that they're not shaken off their path. They're not shaken off their purpose. They continue to articulate what rings through them in the way in which it is being delivered to them. And we, as the people, are able either to receive or deny that energy and so energy cannot be created or destroyed it can only be transferred so knowing this about us as energetic beings when we start to live uh in a space that is in full alignment with what we innately feel connected to driven by spirit no matter what your divinity is right how spirit connects and talks to you how that divine spirit connects and talk to, talks to you is in a unique way that is meant for only you to understand and your journey and your life is for you to start building that understanding and for you to create that tunnel vision so that you do not deter off your path but you get more ingrained into falling deeply in love with who you are and all the pieces that have been put together to create who you exist to be now and the more you stand in your power, the more you fulfill your truth, the more expansive life on this present moment, in this present moment, on this pre present earth becomes for you in each and every breath that you take. And in these last few months, I have been really just experiencing this onset of joy that also comes from so much change and discomfort. In so many things that I have been trying, there has been a level of discomfort that has inched me closer to being my full self because when you are uncomfortable, this is when you are changing, when you are shifting and constantly through life, we are changing and shifting. So we are hit with these different things called tests, but really they're just things. <laughs> it's just life happening to help you shift deeper into who you are meant to be and not who everything else is projecting you to be you have your own time so take it you have your own time so take it under this amazing energy of this beautiful new moon that we have going on right now it is really great to set fire to those intentions and really put yourself in the driver's seat of your life put yourself in the driver's seat of your life and take the wheel hit the gas and say we are going choose the path whether it be straight or all wild with twists and turns and ups and down and enjoy that path enjoy that purpose fall deeply in love with each and every moment because there will be so much deep understanding and fulfillment when you live a life that's truly based in understanding and love i am so thankful 
for everyone who has been just embracing me on my journey as I grow and as I express how I grow and how I share the different phases of Kiara as she becomes more comfortable with being fully expressive of all sides of her without fear, without doubt, without the need of validation from outside source, but really feeling the validation from simply doing what feels right in the heart and knowing that that is all that it takes in order to know that you are good, <laughs> that you are good. Creating more time within my stillness so that I can really tune in and listen and allow. Listen and allow. Listen and allow. I encourage you to take some time to tune in and listen and allow with yourself today, tomorrow, the next week. Underneath this new moon, you know, within our moon phases, you have like the three days prior to the moon phase that you're looking at, right? So the new moon and then the three days after that really help allow you to become and intentionalize what it is you are utilizing this cosmic energy to help you shift through right now. Place your intentions on what it is you know that your dreams are telling you you deserve to receive in this lifetime here and now. I was talking to my homegirl Lizette the other day and... um we were talking about, you know, this fulfillment of path and purpose. And I think that each and every day, it's very important for you to remind yourself of your why. You have to constantly remind yourself of why you do the things you do. And then you have to give yourself grace to feel into that. And because we are all like flowers, like little plants, you know, we are constantly emerging and blooming and showing and then falling back into the earth so we can do it again. And I believe that even in this lifetime, we have many lifetimes, many skins that we shed so that we become more pure, more full, more here, more now, more present in this moment, more activated in our light. And I encourage you to find how you discover your light. I love you. I appreciate you. You mean the moon, the world, the entire Milky Way galaxy to me. And until next time.